Hey guys, uh, so TinyBob on Twitter sent me a link to windowsondevices.com about a month ago and they had a sign up page there and it's basically kind of getting windows onto all these embedded devices and internet of things, you know, the, the hype that's going along for that sort of deal at the moment. So I signed up, I put myself down as an enthusiast, uh, got an email back pretty quickly saying hey, give us your shipping information. Uh, and you know some backup detail of what you do so I sent them to my pie in the wall blog posts and, and stuff and that was kind of a month ago I hadn't heard anything since the email I got said that they might send a development kit uh, so I didn't really get any hopes up but um, about a week ago I got shipping information and yeah this arrived today so see here microprocessor so for development kit um, quite a big you know value on there 150 USD so yeah, said for Microsoft. Let's open it up uh, and see what's inside. It's the first time I've opened it up. It's completely sealed. Um, So, welcome. Very nice. Oh, I think this is the, the real deal here. Galileo board. You've probably seen one of these. Yeah, that's nice. Looks like it's been opened before. Hopefully, it's, I don't mind. It's free. Come on. Uh, not for resale, of course. Ah. Nice. So it runs windows. Um, get this here. I've got some other things here. Just a standard networking cable. <laughs> and a USB network adapter. Wow. Um, I don't actually have one of these, so if it's needed, that's pretty good. Uh, so. You see this? Like Give me an LED. <laughs> they have. They've given me a green LED. Wow, so it's a micro SD adapter with a 16 gig? Yeah, 16 gig card that. Very nice. <laughs> and, wow. <laughs> an LED. I do have a couple of these, you know, just kicking around the work flinch. But yeah, well, nicely packaged at least. Uh, open this up, shall we? When these first came out, I really did actually want to, to get one. They just like, oh. That is smaller than I thought it was. Look at that. Lovely. Oh. Looks really nice. Arduino. Format, of course. Uh, what have I got there? Mini SD card slot. Why have I got that USB? I don't know why I've got this. If you know, it's got it on board, but I'll find out, I'm assuming. So I've got a host USB, USB client. I assume there's some UART. Yeah, the UART's the that one there. Uh, hmm. Some expansion slot of some sort in there. I'll just put this back in here for now. See, I don't know what I'm going to use this for immediately. Um, the first thoughts were with a pie on the wall when it's, you know, Arduino compatible, some sort of really nice kind of you know, you get those small 2.4 gigahertz Arduino Wi-Fi 
transmitter receiver units. Thought it'd be quite nice to have like kind of some sort of bridge to that from the pie because I couldn't, I didn't have enough space to get that into the, the pie in the wall sadly. Uh, it does seem a little bit of a waste though. I mean, it's a really nice looking dev board. Uh, yeah, it's just the power adapters. Every single type of international plug possible. But, yeah, so quite chuffed for that. Um, there's no other documentation. I assume they'll get it on windowsondevices.com, but yeah, this is great. Um, can't wait to get started with this. I'll have to rough that up. I'll take a video when I do that as well. Um, but yeah, exciting. Let me know in any comments if you get some ideas for me. Um, get it open to what to use it for. But I do want to, you know, I want to exploit what it's capable of. I don't want to do something really boring. Yep, thanks very much, guys. See you next time.